What is going on, supporters of all races from all places? My name is Grim Secure. Today we are on episode eight. Episode eight. Totally botched my intro there, but we're cool with it. We're cool with it. Um, yeah, episode eight. So let's do a real quick recap and we'll go from there. So the party that we're going to bring today, because we're going to be doing two gyms, rocket hideout, a few encounters, and uh, one to include the shiny encounter. Uh, this is the team that I've kind of leveled up. The level cap is going to be 35 for the first gym and 34 for the second, so it's kind of odd. Uh, so I've got I've got a couple to 33, one to 32, one to 31. Uh, Flora is still Flora, 26. And then Shucky at 23. I didn't bother putting in any, any more time into Shucky for right now. We'll probably get around to that. But uh, yeah, let's let's pick it up from the top. So as you can see, we top Rock Smash to, to Street Shark. So we'll we'll cover why. We have uh, Street Shark, the Jolly Natured, uh, what's it called? Garchomp, that's the thing. Garchomp with the Yachi Berry. We're still trying to grow Yachi Berries, but Kurt called us, or we called Kurt, and that worked out. So we, we have two more balls, because why not? Um, hydration, not the greatest thing. Slash Rock Smash, uh, Dragon Rage, and Sandstorm. Sandstorm, because I, I guess, why not? Chip damage is always good damage. Rock Smash, because we don't really have fighting coverage now, and I'm tired of pulling Pokemon out of the PC. Plus, after meeting Shucky, we know that there's a Wonder Guard Pokemon afoot. So, um, we know at the very least, Shucky has it. And it's it's weak to the Fighting Ice Steel and something? Fighting Ice Steel and Bug, maybe? I don't remember. Anyway, uh, just for some more coverage, uh, we brought Rock Smash. Next, we have Hannah, the relaxed natured at Houndoom. She has Flash Fire, as is, as is tradition. Uh, with Bite, Ember, Howl, and Smog, we gave up Fire Fang just because she's definitely a special attacker. Um, hopefully we come across Flamethrower at some point in time, or she learns it before the game is over. We have Shiamex, the relaxed natured uh, Crobat. A Sky Plate here. Uh, charcoal on, on hand. A Sky Plate here because Wing Attack. Keen Eye. Um, Bite, Confuse, Ray, Astonish, Wing Attack again. Not too bad, just your typical coverage. I'm really hoping to find Thief, because I need to start running around. I need to try to find Lucky Eggs and Held Items, or other Held Items, that kind of thing. So, I know that she can learn it by TM, but as far as level up goes, I think only Mighty Anna, and I don't believe I have... Uh, what's... what, Poochie Anna? Is that, is that the one? I, I'm, not, I'm not too much of a fan of it, so I never remember it. Anyway, moving on to the MVP, the Timid Nature... Dunsparce, a.k.a. Puddentator, holding a life orb, it has guts. Unfortunately, attack down, special attack up is not really what we're going for, but it is what it is. Headbutt, Roost, Glare, Yawn, that's the best thing we have right now for her. Uh, Jolly Natured Flora with Reckless, really interesting. Everything kind of works as far as this goes. Uh, I know that it's mostly a special attacker anyways, I believe. I believe Venusaur is normally a special attacker, but the joke being that its special moves aren't great. Regardless, Reckless will take down, which is really cool. We have Razor Leaf, Leech, uh, Leech Seed, and Sleep Powder. Really cool. And finally, we have the Relaxed Nature Chucky with a Lax Incense. Lax Incense just because I don't have leftovers, because that's going to be extremely toxic. Defense up, speed down, which is perfect, because it's much more uh, of a tank on the special side, so that makes up for it. Wonder Guard, again, weak only to Fighting, Steel, Ice, and I, I think Bug. Because I, I think, was it Grass? Grass Rock? Something like that? Yeah, Grass Rock. And I think Rock doesn't resist bug with those weird ones. Uh, this is going to be our Giratina Killer. As dumb as that sounds. Because Giratina only learns um, Aura Sphere by level up to hit it, which is level 56. Which is real late game, and it's not stabbed. So, we see a Giratina. We just send in Shucky and, and hope for the best. Um... Astonish, Confuse Ray, Acid, Ingrain on a Wonder Guard. Really can't complain. Really can't complain. I keep thinking that, that this is the, the final form, but it evolves into Cradilly, so really cool. All right, long intro done. I think we're all healed up. We're just going to run right into Jasmine's gym. We're just going to start it. I think we literally just run to Jasmine because all the trainers are technically the ones in the lighthouse, which I guess makes sense here. But yeah, we're just, we're just going to run it down. We'll see what happens. Oh, I guess not. Okay. Well, I thought it was just run right to her. Steel type. Yeah, we'll we'll see if that's a thing. We have Garchomp at the front. We're just going to run it. Uh, new to come here. Thanks for all the gym leader. Cool, cool. Oh. 
Oh, okay, I guess we do just run it. Sweet. Cable at the lighthouse, show that side. Well, that's, okay, perfect. This, <laughs> strong start, we take this. All right, well, just to fill in the save, because I have no idea why I'm saving right now. It's a Nuzlocke. Uh, question of the day, before we fight Jasmine, who is your favorite trainer of the entire series? Not just HeartGold SoulSilver, not just this Nuzlocke, but in general, who is your favorite trainer? Mine would probably have to be Silver. I really like his backstory. I like how even though he's a bad guy, he has a Crobat, which shows that he's a kind trainer. Um, I love Team Rocket, and he's Giovanni's son. You know, so many, so many things I like about him. Also, the fact that his hair is red was kind of the start of... Oh! <laughs> All right, well, we prepared for this, right? We prepared for this. We have a Rock Smash. Uh, what would have been the way to take this out if we didn't have this? Do we have anyone else that could actually damage it? Um, we could have hit it with a status. Like, we could get uh, Confuse Rate it and just let that happen. Okay, we would have had other options. We would have had other options. Oh, well, we'll, just, we'll Rock Smash it. We'll let it happen. Um, yeah, so I love Silver. I think I think he's great. And like I was saying, the, oh, cool. We'll lower his defense. Red hair is kind of was kind of what started the whole. My favorite color is red, anyways. So, dates way back to OG silver and gold. All right, cool. So, not an issue there. Level thirty, Lily taken out. And Anarith, I think. I think I think I can still hit it with Rock Smash. That, that probably works. Um, it's definitely gonna resist my slash. Oh, okay. I guess it doesn't matter. Definitely gonna resist slash. I don't think too concerned about that. Dragon Rage. Protect. All right. Yeah, good. Good talk, Anarith. Good talk. I'm uh, I'm definitely having some issues training right now just because a lot of the Pokemon are very, very low level. Anywhere from 15 to, like, 25. And I just... I'm just I'm just not getting what I'm what I'm going for here. Okay. Yeah, she could, she could absolutely use a Hyper Potion on this. Better than her Ace. Not very, was that a crit? Wait, that actually wasn't a crit? Nah, I guess it doesn't matter. Jesus, stop with the protect. Stop with the protect. Please. Uh, we'll just we'll just spam Dragon Rage until it goes down. I think I think the only good move that I get on Garchomp as far as level up goes is Dragon Claw. And that's not until. That's not until level, like, 56, I think, is what they put it at in Gen 4. So... What is it? 56 is Dragon Claw. It's like 62 is Crunch. So we, we won't have a full-fledged a full-fledged full Garchomp unless we get really lucky with our TMs. And the, okay, the ace is Wismer. Awesome. Wismer, that, that's my starter. Uh, cool, we have Rock Smash. Awesome. <clears throat> so putting Rock Smash on this actually helped out a bunch. Um, I don't know if I should be... Okay, I'll take a crit. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> Alright, well, one gym leader down, so she technically had the highest level of them. The other place is just... Uh, what? Two Pokemon? Does he have three Poke? Two or, th or three Pokemon, I think. Uh, you're better trainer than me in both skill and kindness in the Coastal League rules. Give me the badge. Mineral badge. We take that. We will take that. I'm sure I was talking about something, but now it's in the past and I forgot. Pokemon up to 70. Girl, are you kidding me? What is the scaling for this game? Because her max was 35. Okay, thank God it's not Iron Tail. Let's let's check out to see what it actually is. Because one of these times, like, we just need to get something good. Rock Smash, Fly, Belly Drum. What'd she say it was? Wait, was it 70? Ugh. So, Fury Attack would be fine for our scaling Pokemon, like our Ambipom. Which I think it could also get Belly Drum. So, like, we could technically do Belly Drum Fury Attack with Leftovers or something. Or Citrus Berry for our skill linkers. Uh, Sky Attack Online. Uh, we ended up getting Sunny Day. I don't remember from where, but it doesn't really help us. Uh, Spore. Was that? I don't remember where I got Spore either. All right. Well, ooh, oh, wait, hold on. Aurora Beam. Where did we get Aurora Beam from? Can, can anyone learn it? I don't think any of these people can learn it by... Or naturally. So unless it's just... Yeah, definitely not. I want to say Pudentator can learn Ice Beam. But that's... We're not, we're not going to be using that. 
All right, let's uh, let's go heal up. We're gonna cut to. Uh, okay, Joey, what do you want? Different from other Earth Springs. Yep. All right. Well, I guess we start out every episode with with a call from someone at this point, so that's that's cool. All right, we're going to heal up, and then we'll cut to. Um, our encounter right outside Mahogany Town. It's the same. It's the same route that we got something earlier, but it's a completely different spawn table, and it's on another side of a cave. So we'll uh, we'll we'll cut to there. We'll grab that. I, I feel like counting that as a, as an encounter, anyways, because there's not too many encounters left. I don't believe until we get over to Kanto. So let's go, and I'll see you there. And here we are on Route 42. We ended up getting a fishing encounter on the other side of this water. Um, we got, I believe we got a Feebas. But this is a completely different spawn table. And even though it's not a different route, it kind of is. Um, I didn't utilize our Rock Smash encounter outside of the Ruins of Elf just because it was the same name. So I'll just I'll just kind of take that that opportunity here. Um, a Barboach. All right, so it's not like we really gained anything from this. I actually almost would just rather kill it and move on. But we we won't. You never know. You never know what it is. It, it could be like Sap Zipper. So let's hit it with let's hit it with a yawn. I think it's easier to catch if it's asleep versus it being paralyzed by a little bit. Not a whole lot of damage. All right, we got a Whiskash. I can't say I'm too happy about that, and it's probably going to sit in the PC, but you never know. Well, I guess not a Whiskash, a Barboach, a future Whiskash. Oh, man, we have a lot of four times. Not, th thankfully, not on the team. We have one four times on the team, but... Uh, we're going to we're gonna name you... I really have no good nickname. Um, I guess I just call you Caddy because you're a catfish. I I don't I have no idea. Completely uninspired by this thing. There's a chance that Caddy has. I've already fought these trainers too. Um, there's a chance that Caddy has a good held item, which would which would be nice. I guess best case scenario is either held item or some amazing ability. But I just I don't really see I don't see a world where this Pokemon really even exists to us. Um, are we in box two already? Barbo. Oh, there it is up at the top. Okay, so replace the quick feet. Oh, yeah. Not the best. Bold nature, not terrible, I guess. Attack down, defense up. I mean, I guess I'd rather it be a little bit tanky. Um, boost speed if there's a status problem. Not, not terrible. Not terrible. I, like, I guess with quick feet, with something that can be a little beefy, like rest, sleep talk. Leftovers isn't terrible, but it's it's the, I don't think it's gonna happen. So here we are in Mahogany Town, uh, arguably one of the one of the coolest towns in the, in the series. Uh, I, I wish they made it a little bit bigger because it, it it could be really cool. It's a nice. It, it feels like a like a dark woods kind of place. I, I guess hence the name Mahogany. Uh, I don't remember what the order that we're supposed to do things, or the, the order that we're supposed to do things in here. We can't go to the gym until we beat the Rocket Hideout, which is right here. I don't know how to start that. I know that we have an encounter up north. Red Gyarados appeared. Oh, well, it looks like I'm talking to the MVP. What's up, buddy? Happily cuddling. Goddamn right. Yeah, goddamn right. Okay, we don't care about that. I don't think we need to use the radio. I don't think we need to do the radio tower thing. So we'll go see what we can do. We'll see if we can get... Oh, I don't have my Surf Pokemon. Son of a... All right, well, let's... Let's speed this up real quick. I, I'm going to try to, again, I say it a lot. I'm going to try my best to not use the speed up. But it always ends up happening anyways, so I think I just need to accept it. Most of you probably already have. Uh, here's our Surf Pokemon. We'll get rid of... I, I think I'm just going to keep Credilly in our party at all times now. Even even if it's not the the best Pokemon, it, it's, it's literally just a, a Wonder Guard answer to Giratina. All right, pressing. I don't think this guy says anything to us. Heard that you could find a red scale occasionally. What was a red scale for? What was the red scale about? And is it is it on the static? I feel like it's on the static. Okay, 
So we're at 43. Did I already fight him? Were they even an encounter? Anyway, we're at 43 encounter. A Flaffy. That's... I think Flaffy's here normally, isn't it? I'm about, I'm actually about this. And it has Intimidate. No way. That's perfect. That's actually perfect. I, I feel like I still kill it, but... We needed an Electric type, so... That's actually really... I, f I feel like I would... I feel like I'd rather have a Flaffy than a Venusaur, as, as dumb as that sounds, right? I mean, one is a good stall. The other, we'll see. We'll see. I'll have to... I'll do away my options here, but... Um, what is... Yeah, we got two Heavy Balls. I'm, I'm so happy about that. And my favorite ball, a Premier, Premier Ball. I made sure I got one of those. Uh, let's try to get Flaffy in a Premier Ball. I'm about it. I know it probably won't work as full health and not asleep yet, but you never know. Two... Tracer, awesome. Uh, we've been we've been extremely lucky with with catching things. I don't know if it was a Heart Gold Soul Silver thing or if it's just I'm not really going against any difficult Pokemon to catch. I feel like Garchomp should have been the hardest one for me to catch though. Uh, all right, Wool Pokemon, Fluffy Fleece, easily stores electricity, rubbery hide keeps from being electrocuted. I'm gonna name you Orb, just because I love the the little orb on its tail. And I feel like Orby is too childish. I really don't want to do that. So we know it has Intimidate. That's really cool. Let's uh, let's run it back real quick. I, I want to see if it has a held item. Because at this point, we are... Like, I, I feel like we have we have enough... Enough of a box for a couple of good teams. So even if I lose a Pokemon, I don't think it's going to set us back. Even if we lost, like, half a party, I don't think it would set us back too much just because we're that stacked right now. Intimidate, Mild Nature. All right. All right, we'll take that. Uh... Well, defense and special attack. That's not that's not the best. But Intimidate does help with the defense drop, so that, that works. Uh, I don't think we need a Thunderstone for it. Is it a Thunderstone evolution? I, I don't think so. I don't think so. Do we have a Thunderstone, though? Just to, just to see. I'm not too good with my stone evolutions. Damn, blah, 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 blah. Shiny Stone. No, nah, we do not have a Thunderstone. We do not. But we could always... Well, uh, I forgot we have choice specs. That'd be sick. Choice specs uh, Ampharos would be really, really good. Quick, quick Claw Ampharos would also be really, really good. Um, I don't think it matters if we have a slow Pokemon, especially if we level up to the to the Aces level. I think that that, that saves us a lot of a lot of heartache. All right, we we have our Surf Pokemon. That's pretty cool. Let's let's run up and see what's up there. I'm fairly certain that. You normally run up there first because Lance is up there? Is that right? And then Gyarados is a static, so we'll see what that turns into. Oh. I guess we're fighting things. Did they wait, did they actually take a thousand? I'm I'm a broke bitch right now. I have three thousand of my name. You know what? That's fine, whatever. I'll, I'll get it back from you two later. I'm cool with that. A dome fossil? Okay, so we have two dome fossils now. I'm about that one from Rock Smash earlier than that one. So I'm I'm cool to I'm cool to ability ability hunt. Um if we fight if, if the trainers look at us, we'll fight them. A Vespa Oh, I would have been so happy with a Vespa Quinn. I would have been so happy with a Vespa Quinn. That's fine. It would have been another four times weakness, so I'm not I'm not too concerned. Okay, so Lake of Rage. So Lake of Rage has two things to it. We have the static and we have a regular encounter. And like I could always surf out to it. I feel like that's a that's a smart idea. Are you are you person? Do I talk to you afterwards? I feel like someone gives us a a super rod too. I feel I feel like I would rather just I feel like I'd rather take the level hit just to make sure it's an easier it's an easier capture so we'll, we'll use a good rod I guess I guess technically I could have used the old rod but whatever that's fine that's fine we're all just waiting for the for the shiny anyways a jinx I really could have done without a jinx okay so it's raining in the area she doesn't have drizzle Wait a minute. So, yo, wait. Okay, so we have a... Wait, hold on. So we have an ice type with snow warning. I was actually just going to headbutt her and kill her, but... 
I believe that still makes Blizzard 100% accurate. Right? Is that true? Okay. Uh, okay. All right. It can't. It can't be five times. I don't care about that. Hit her with a Pokeball. What do we? What do we use here? A Great Ball? I, f I feel like a Great Ball would be good enough to catch her. Okay. I guess I'm just lying. Powder Snow. She's asleep. Let's try one more Great Ball before we. Perfect. Awesome. So all we needed was for her to be asleep. Sweet. Uh, the, the human-shaped Pokemon. I'm not 100% on that. Speaks a language similar to that of humans. However, it seems to use dancing to communicate. All right. Well, I really don't know what to name her then. Let's name her. Let's name her Lippy. Again, fairly uninspired by the name. Well, I'll just have to. We'll just have to deal with it. Let's. I, I've been rarely using any any potions too, so I might as well just use my potions outside of battle to heal up the little bit of damage that they do. Cool. All right, we have, a, we have a surf Pokemon, so we're just gonna we're just gonna run out. I don't think this little guy says anything right here. It's angry. It's a bad omen. That's sick. All right, well, let's see. Let's see what this what the static is. I don't remember that this was that a is that like a little mouse. Oh no, it's a Shanks, and it's a male. That's really cool. That's really cool. I'll take it. A shiny Shanks is going to be our static. All right, so it's raining, so that's not necessarily good. I don't think it has thunder. That would be extremely far fetched. Um, I could I could probably head up. Jesus. If this if this thing has takedown, like we just lose, right? Uh, I try to color coordinate all my shinies. Luckily, Ultra Ball works here. Even if it didn't, like I'm not gonna take that risk. I'm fairly certain it knows. I'm fairly certain that it knows takedown. Just stand the ball, please. Just stand the ball. Sweet. Awesome. We need an electric type. We got two of them today. This is this is a damn good start. This is a damn good start. Uh, the Flash Pokemon. The blah, 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 blah. I'm not going to read it. I already know I'm going to name it Scar. Completely inspired by... Th I love... I love Shinx. Scar. Perfect. Okay, and you get the red scale from it no matter what. Sweet. We take that. Lance doing Lancings. Uh, let's see. You Crimson, I'm Lance, a trainer like you. Heard rumbling, so I came to investigate. Saw the way you battled. Cool. Trainer. Skill. Mine. Yeah, help you investigate the rocket hideout. I'm down with it. Souvenir shop. All right, sweet. So that's how we progress it. That's good. Oh man, come on! Like the dragon is big enough. Like I could probably fly back. That's fine. Oh, fishing guru. Wait, is this to do with the super rod? Don't tell me I missed my chance with, with getting the fishing. Yeah, I probably did. Oh, I guess not. Okay. I, I always I always feel like it was it was that other dude who Oh, is it is it this guy now? Oh. Uh, okay, okay. Well I guess we're just gonna fight Trainer Joe with a soul rock. I don't I don't think I'm I don't think I'm too worried about a soul rock. I can't hit it too hard with, with Puddin Tater, but Psy Wave. I mean I, I guess I should be pretty cognizant of their levels because their levels are getting up there. And that did absolutely nothing. I keep forgetting I have Life Orb. All right, let's 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 not be dumb here. Let's not be dumb. So Psychic Rock type. Psychic Rock type. Rock type hits me super effectively, but it is Psychic, right? I have Astonish on on Hannah. I do not. I have Bite. I, you know what? That that's fine. I I can do this. And it's gonna rock polish. Okay, sweet. That's that's like I, th I think I, I think I take that. Rock polish again. It's the fastest thing that existed. Perfect. Thirty four. Uh, we are going to utilize level thirty five as our level cap merely because we still have an entire hideout. I, I'm not I'm not gonna talk to you. You're just you're just that guy. All right. Ah, oh, I can't fly down. All right. We'll uh, we'll cut to the Pokemon Center and then we'll we'll do the 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 rock hideout. We'll be right back. All right, we are back in Mahogany Town. I took out Flora. I, I haven't looked at any of our encounters just yet, um, but I do remember that Puntator can headbutt. So 
We'll try to hit some trees, I guess. Wait, is he gonna keep walking in front of me? That's kind of annoying. Hold on. Am I able to do it this way? Oh, it's, okay. I see. I, I see why this is gonna be really annoying. Let's switch him with Hannah. Okay, there we go. So I guess it's not every time you headbutt that it works, but it's a percentage chance if the tree is going to be an encounter tree. I think that's that's what I found out uh, when I did my last attempt at a headbutt encounter. So we'll, we'll headbutt each of these a, a few times and see if anything pops up. All right, I guess there's no encounters here. I, I don't believe that the randomizer randomizes the headbutt encounters. So when we finish all this, we might just grab an encounter on one of the trees outside. I know that that won't let us pass. So I guess we'll just press to the Team Rocket hideout. I, okay, I think a Hyper Beam would kill a man. Well, let's see what we got going on here. We should split up, check the place. I'm down. I feel like we should probably check this guy. Buddy, are you all right? I mean, it doesn't matter what type of Pokemon it is. You just took a, a point-blank Hyper Beam. All right. Well, it is what it is. He's breathing. Oh, this is the... So there... I think this is the... You have an encounter every single... Every single checkpoint, correct? That sounds right. I think there's also static Pokemon, too. It'd be nice if there was a random encounter and static Pokemon. Let's see what these rocket levels are. Artesian Jessica sends out Gorbis. Le level 17, all right. So we're, we're a little bit higher of a level than we need to be. I don't even, I honestly don't even believe that I need to worry about <laughs> my tight matchup, yeah. All right. Well, I mean, I, I, guess, I guess I can swap another Pokemon to the front. Starly, what, also level 17? Okay, this one's 19. Still not a big deal. Yeah. Not a big deal at all. I fear that it's going to be very, very difficult to level later with all these. Oh, oh, there's, there's two. Okay, well, that's fine. That is fine. Three this time. An Empoleon of oh, level 16. All right, well, I was, I was really hoping. It's Water Seal, I got Stab, it's neutral. Let's do it. I don't see a w wow it actually oh boy I'm not too concerned about a bubble yeah I'm not too concerned about a bubble like fully evolved Pokemon are gonna give me a, a decent amount of experience which is really nice okay need okay now is that download why do so many things have download oh I did not mean to just press ember that wasn't even on speed up that was just me being dumb I mean, it was exactly what I what I meant to do because I knew it was gonna one hit. I knew that. Okay, so, like this is a, a lot of experience, so that that's really nice. Crawdon, I'm not really too concerned about Crawdon right now. I'll just hit it with a bite. Does wait? Does does Dark resist Dark? I feel like you know what? That's fine. Let's. Yeah, Dark resist Dark. Okay, let's let's not hit me with it. Okay, cool. He, he's a physical attacker. I'm not too worried about a bubble from him. Sweet. Hit it with an Ember then. Yeah, that, that Nido King could have been a, a big issue had I totally didn't know what I was going to hit it with. All right, so is that it? Is it just, is it two encounters per? Because that, that seems kind of, kind of odd. I don't remember it being, I don't remember fighting two people at each one at all. There, oh, see, there's an item down there. I really, I did, I did find a couple items sitting on the ground in the Lake of Rage. Uh, I guess they're not hidden on the ground. They were, they were out in the open. Uh, one I got, so I got Sacred Ash, which was really cool. Not that we could really utilize it too much. We ended up getting Sky Uppercut, which is really cool. Amnesia, did we get Amnesia there? Or did we get it after, regardless, Amnesia and then dude, oh no, no, no that's right, that's right. Uh, we were supposed to get Hidden Power, but it ended up being Sky Uppercut. Yeah, so we get Sky Uppercut and, Am and Amnesia. So that was, that was it. I'm gonna try to keep myself from getting up to, to level 35, if I can. I'll get Street Shark up to, up to a level or two. So like 33, 34. 
I imagine this guy wants to fight. Yeah, wants a, wants a ninja hideout. Are there any ninjas in Gen 1 and Gen 2? I think they were introduced in Gen 3, right? When they were they were hidden behind the, the tree cover. All right, so this is just a normal type right now. Yeah, I'm fairly certain that that, that class was added in Gen 3, but there was never... I, I mean, I guess Koga, right? Koga and his daughter? Technically, but they weren't ninja class. Okay, Charizard, I'm, I'm fine with this too. Rock Smash is not the answer here. Sandstorm is also not the answer here. I think I think Slash is fine. I've never seen a Charizard carry Ice Beam, so I think I'm cool. Yeah, and I, I don't care about a Growl, because I always have Dragon Rage if I need it. Hit it with a Slash. This should be it. Right, just two Pokemon. Three Pokemon. I probably should have been paying attention. All right, and a Poliwag. Uh, I think I think we could get away with a slash. If we crit, then the attack drop didn't matter. I guess the attack drop didn't matter anyways. Designer Pansy. <laughs> oh, you poor, poor person. Choice Specs. Okay, like, it's cool to have Choice Specs, but, like, that's the second one. I, I have a Choice Scarf and Choice Specs. I, I'd really like Choice Band now. Because I feel like Choice Band... It's something I could definitely use in place of, like, Metronome. But I would... I'd really like to have... I'd really like to start building some Pokemon for... For, uh, Red at this point. Because it's, it's gonna be... It, it's gonna be a thing. Alright, what do we have here? But she's in Jessica, two Pokemon, Gorbis again. Do they all have, are all of these fights, do they all start with Gorbis? Is that just like the generic replacement Mon that they normally have? How does it live on one? I feel like it lived on one last time and either I'm just getting some really bad, really bad low rolls or they're actually pretty bulky and I don't remember Gorbis being bulky. Oh, wait. Wait, hold on. I'm learning Dragon Claw at 30. Oh, wait, no, no. I knew I knew I was Dragon Claw at 33. I'm stupid. I knew that. Jeez. Uh, I, I still think Stan Sandstorm is good here. I feel like Dragon Rage is no longer good. Yeah, because Dragon Rage is now is locked into 40. So even if I get... Is this high crit? No, nah, it's not high crit, but it, it's pretty strong. I feel like it's always going to hit over 40 unless they... Resist it. Yeah, I'll I'll get rid of Drag Rage. I think it's about that time. I think it's about that time. I think both both the AI and you know and I have have outgrown Dragon Rage. Starly again, what nineteen? Okay, so it's just it's just a generic fight with them. Okay, that's totally fine. So it's just what three slashes to to finish these fights. That's so. Does that mean that I have a second fight against someone identical? My turn, no escape, yep. I think it's the same text as last time. Three Pokemon, Jonathan again, Empoleon, all right. So just the, the same fight over. Uh, I, I mean, I guess it could be using, I guess I could be using, um, oh, I had rough skin, jeez. I, I guess I could probably use um, Brick Break on it. I can use Brick Break in all these Pokemon, right? Because Steel, Dark, and whatever the other one was. We're just... We're, we're, we're just going to speed up. I'm sorry. Uh, there's... Like, we've literally already seen this fight. And then after this, dude, I'd probably have to fight that guy right there. They can see me, correct? Guess no. Feeling lucky, Punk. Go ahead and take another step. Oh, there's explosives on the floor. Wait, is it actual explosives or is it electrodes? Ooh, a Yan Mega. Quick attack. Awesome. Nidorino with download, of course. Speeding out through. Squirtle, yep. Check a remix. Rocket remix. Intimidate there. Don't care. Awesome. All right. Thanks, Daniel. Oh, okay. Okay, these are the explosives. Interesting. Interesting. So do I, do I want to go down there? Is this a static or is you know we'll we'll count this. Oh no, no, we already have one. Okay. 
it's an abom- Oh, boy. Yeah, we don't want to deal with that. Okay, cast from. So, so we'll count this as our Team Rocket encounter. We won't count it as a static just because I think there's three electrodes. Each one should be a different thing. And I feel like cast form isn't going to break the game. So uh, let's... Ooh, Rock Smash will end this thing's whole career. Let's hit it with a Sandstorm and see what happens. And, okay, and apparently it wants to do Hail. No, okay. Oh, it doesn't transform, so it doesn't... Interesting. Interesting. Is this difficult to catch? Because I really don't want to. I really don't want to deal with. Okay, thank you. I was going to say I don't want to do weather battle. Uh, the weather Pokemon. Uh, the Pokemon change itself. Thank you, forms. Um, I feel like I normally name it Doppler, but since it's a female, I'll name it Doppler. Box two. It, it's it's so nice to see Box two at this point. And I think I just I think I just keep walking down. Cast form again. Yeah, we, we, we really don't care here. Oh. That, that's pretty interesting. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna hit this with a save just because I, I have no idea why I have this bad habit of always wanting to save. Oh, it brought me right to the beginning. Oh, okay, it's not it's not too bad. Alright. Is it if I stop? Okay. I'll take that then. I'm totally fine with that. Uh, oh, cool. There's there's Lance. Doing Lance things. You alright? Your Pokemon are hurt and tired? Oh, okay, cool. I'll just, I'll take the free heal. Absolutely. That kind of makes me want to go over here, though. Kind of makes me want to go over here. I know it's going to be, it's going to be the same two fights again, isn't it? Intruder alert. Yeah, it's the same text. Two Pokemon. Gore. Okay. Yeah, here we go. It will just, uh, again, I, I'm sorry. We're just, I guess we're just going to run through these two. Um, that's gonna be the other one. I'm level 34. Oh, man. So, the... I believe the very last... The very last fight in the Rocket Hideout, I believe, is a double battle? Potentially? Um, if that's the case, it, it is what it is. So, oh, Star Piece. Good. We'll be able to sell that. I'm down. I, I really don't know if I want to do another one of these fights, honestly. Uh, we'll get Shemex up one more level. Intruder alert again, right? Yep, Intruder alert. Well, I mean, at least they're weak Pokemon. I'm cool with that. Like, I'll always, I'll always take a free win. I wonder, I wonder if Flora just wants to level up. I would love to give the leap some levels, but right now it's just, I feel like it's a, it's a little bit out of out of the question. Rough skin, yeah, that's cool, dog. Crawdon, yeah, again, that's cool, dog. And then Nido King. I'll be honest, I'm actually surprised Crobat one shot Nido Nido King. I thought it was gonna be, that was gonna be a couple of hits that I needed right there. Oh, perfect. Uh, spell. Well, I mean, I guess the spell tag isn't too bad. I think that that does that raise ghost types or yeah, raises ghost types because cleanse tag keeps away wild Pokemon. All right, perfect. Yeah, we're not gonna touch that right now. We're just we're just gonna do the thing. Uh, yeah, I wish I did that before, before the whole Lance thing. Let's, just because we know that there's going to be a double battle at some point, let's make sure that our first two Pokemon at least synergize pretty well. Where is Freshwater? Oh, I, I use all my regular potions already. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Pokemon. Uh, who'd go well with GMX? I feel like, I mean, I feel like Street Shark just goes well with everything. Uh, what's wrong against this? Psychic. So then Hannah and Rock. Um, he also has a ghost move. Okay, so I, I think I think we'll just put Street Shark up there. I think that, that makes a lot of sense. Oh, hello. I almost fought you. And I almost did it again on accident because I'm a moron. No hidden items over here or anything. Oh, damn. Well, I, I mean, I can't be upset that it's a premier ball. It is my favorite ball. I'm going to say that. A lot. Let's let's go over here and see what's going on. Okay, let's see if the door checks a voice of person saying the password before it opens. Is do I need to go and get like? Well, okay, we'll we'll, we'll progress this way a little bit. See what happens. Um, let's see. It has to have a password that only Team Rocket knows. Cool. One Pokemon, which means it's gonna be pretty strong, and it's a Cyndaquil. and it's not even strong. All right, cool. Well, look at me be wrong. Uh, hit it with a wing attack and probably quick attack. All right. I mean, hey, any damage is good damage for you at this point, right? 
720. What do you have to say? Just team rock. Regret, don't know the password. Too bad. Yeah, it is too bad for me, isn't it? Why would we make this easy? Okay, so Shiamex is doing Shiamex things. Puntator can start doing Puntator things. So that, that'd be really cool. We'll do the, we'll, you know, we'll do the old combo right there. The old tag team combo with the, the dragon and wishes it was a dragon. Oh, no, the double battle is with, is with Lance, isn't it? But he has a Dragonite. Okay, that's that's fine. You need the voice of a certain person. Uh, Petrel. That's fine. That's fine. What's up here? What are you? A dive ball. Okay. All right. I'll, I'll take I'll take any specialty ball. I feel like that just that's just extremely convenient. Acupressure. Um, does acupressure work? Because I think it raises a random stat. I could be wrong. Acupressure, acupressure. There it is. User applies pressure to stress point, sharply boosting one of its stats. See, that's really cool. That's really cool. I don't care about this. Okay, well, I care about this guy. Yuck, yuck, yuck. <laughs> yeah, all right. Challenging you to a battle. All right. Password to the boss's room. Wait, hold on. Is it this guy? No, I don't think so. All right. I was hoping. Tyro, nice. Question is, do you have fake out though? Do you have fake out though? Doesn't look like it. You don't even survive though. All right, all right. Tyro might actually be one of the the Pokemon that I shiny hunt next. I, I I really need a shiny hit on top. Oh wait, what do you say, Radicate Tail? I could be. What do you say, Radicate Tail? If you don't have both passwords, no one cares. Cool. Two items here, escape rope, awesome. I bought some escape ropes earlier, still yet to use one. Flame orb, oh my god. Oh, there we go, all right. That's, th this is exactly what we needed. This is exactly what we needed. It might seem dumb, but it's it's gonna be a thing. Give Pokemon, give it to Puntator. Uh, do I wanna give? I would love to give Life Orb to someone else, but not unless they could actually heal a decent amount. So, like, I'd give it to Flora if it had Synthesis, but it doesn't yet. Um, if Crobat got Roost. All right, we're, we're going to hold off on that. But we do have a Life Orb free, which is huge. Absolutely huge. The fact that we got, the fact that we got Flame Orb, though, I, I am just about that. Protect with two passwords. All right, so we already got Radicate Tail. I feel like it's one of these people. Do I know the password? Maybe. No weakling is going to get it. Cool. I mean, good news is I, I, I'm i not a weakling. I mean, at least I don't think I'm a weakling. I could be wrong. Artesian Alex. All right, what up, girl? What you got? Marowak. All right, so what do we do here? I think we yawn, right? So I feel like the, tac or the tactics are hit him with a yawn. Okay, Bone Club. Excuse me. Okay, that's kind of a weird... I mean, that's fine. So now I'm burned. Now we know that he that he goes to sleep, right? So hypothetically, I'm going to be slower than a lot of things, but what I would do now is now I'd Roost so that they do their thing. Focus Energy, awesome. So now he has a chance to crit. I'm going to take some damage. He's going to go to sleep. And now I have a Guts Boosted Stab Headbutt. Which I feel like normally it survive, well, by a lot more than that. I, I still take that. And the cool thing is, it's guts, and I could just leave it burned until I go to the PC. But also, that's interesting. That's interesting because I could do guts boost to get it burned before an important battle heal it up and then give it a different item like choice band or like life orb that's actually crazy all right well we'll get through this yeah that's what i thought you're not you're not gonna you're not gonna make it slowpoke tail cool all right so now we hit it with a with a potion and because it has roost this is that well that's actually kind of kind of a broken combo um that's actually an extremely broken combo. Get the burn. Get the burn. Four guts. Fully heal. 
Hit him with a life orb. That's that's crazy. I feel like I feel like going over here is gonna have its its advantages. Alright, let's do this. Polywag. One and done. Take a little bit of damage from Flame Orb. Or from the burn. Headbutt. <laughs> a little bit of damage. Kakuna. Headbutt. Okay. Well, there we go. So we know that we're roughly 50% stronger. So let's put that on a scale. What is my physical attack right now? My physical attack is 10, minus 10%, unfortunately, but it's 47. So if I were to do some quick math, half of 47 is going to be something like... 23 and a half rounded up which is 24 so 47 and 24 is something like what one four five seven 71 so 71 attack which is 30 less than that 71 attack. okay so it's roughly it makes me roughly as strong as my crowbat makes me roughly as strong as my crowbat plus if i give it a life orb it's going to make it 33 percent stronger which 33 percent of 70 means that hypothetically Potentator being burned with a life orb is going to be just as strong as my street shark but with a choice band about 10 percent to 20 percent stronger if my math is right than a garchomp i i think i think there's i think there's some some potential here i th i definitely think there's some potential here um did i come down from here i did not but i will always take an item power whip though Power Whip, though. Now, the question is, can I actually teach Power Whip to Venusaur? Or is it going to be one of those TMs that it doesn't normally learn? Power Whip. Let's see here. Unable. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. I mean, I, I don't want to be happy, so it's okay. That's okay. If I keep running into to this kind of issue, I just, might, I just might go the Powders route and say, a Nuzlocke is a Nuzlocke. It is what it is. It is what it is. Um... A double battle is going to be really interesting because I don't know if I can't one-shot something and then I get double focus, I could lose Puddentator. But we've really had no... We've really had no real drama on this run yet. So I, I might I might just do it. I might just do it. Oh, it's a... Oh, boy. I didn't think about this. I didn't know there was a rival battle. All right, Violet. What you got? Messing with them again. Must really like Team Rocket so much. I really do. Yeah, I got one of those Pokemon Center, you know, limited edition Team Rocket hats. I got one of those. What's up? Uh, don't care that I lost. I could beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. What he told me bothers me. Dark, dark, dark. I lost your bleeding heart. Like, you don't have the time for the likes of you. Oh, do we? Oh, do we actually not fight? Do we not fight? Okay, I'm fine with that. Uh, a Fluffy Tail. I don't think a Fluffy Tail helps us. Is, does that help us run from battle? Is that what it is? Um, what is it down here? Nope. What kind of item is Fluffy Tail? It's a health item, right? I can't find it. I mean, would that mean that I already have one then? We're gonna, we're gonna figure this out. We're gonna figure this out. It's not there. It's definitely not there. Oh, here we go. That's right. I literally just saw that. Uh, use the flea from any battle from wild Pokemon. Okay. I mean, or a Pokedoll, because... We could just use that instead. Uh, Puntator's full health. Doors closed. Enter the two passwords. Door open. All right. I think we fight that. I'm, I'm going to save it just, just because. Uh, this episode is actually taking quite a bit. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to... Not going to stop here. We're going to end it with the rocket hideout. We're going to start the next one with the gym battle. And then we will get to the following gym. And then we'll, we'll start the next two episodes with a gym battle. I think... All right, well, I guess my, my last three. This one... The, the next one and the one following so that's that's totally fine that's totally fine all right what is it giovanni uh we've been waiting for you sir crimson me you don't know who i am it's me giovanni the majestic giovanni himself that nah, doesn't sound like giovanni oh hey <laughs> yeah it don't sound anything like giovanni don't even look like him how come work so hard to mimic him well i mean it could be because of purple hair but that's cool dog and I don't think you'd have a Murkrow. Password is Hail Giovanni. Surprised to hear it from me, knowing the password won't help you, though. Cool. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Cristiano. This guy looks like a creep. He's a doctor, though. Jesus. All right, Chime Echo. What you got? Okay, you got Rain. I'm actually okay with this. I'm actually okay with this. That means I could swap into a fire type with my grass up if I need to. So, hit him with the headbutt. I feel like it died. Really? 
Okay, I could deal without the uproar. Because that, uh, like that, could, that could do some damage here. Rain happens, fire happens, cool. Hit him with another headbutt. Does he not have a potion? I feel like, I feel like he should have a potion. I was really hoping he was going to use it there, though. I wonder what his ace is. I wonder what its level is, too. A Pelipper. Okay. Uh, well, th this isn't the ace, but... It's raining and it could have Hurricane. So I think we just Roost. What level does Pelipper get Hurricane at? I feel like that's that's what the real question is here. Missed. Okay, changes. Right? Status changes? Or is it... No, that's Defog. Does Miss make it so he can't be... Affected by another safe card. Is it an accuracy thing? He was flinch. I'm just gonna speed through this because Pelipper sucks. Polytoad is better. A star you. Okay, I'm not I'm not too concerned about a star you. Cam what's camouflage do? Okay. Trans it transformed into the normal type. That's cool, I guess. Alright. Well, since bit uh since the Team Rock three years ago, or Giovanni has been missing. Uh, we're certain he's waiting for the right time for our arrival. Losing you won't change the fact that you are unable to get into the transmitter room. I mean, unless we... Oh, wait, no, because the, the Murkrow can repeat it. Alright, I'm down. I'm down with that. Oh, we're... Don't you follow it. I want to see what's on this computer. Nothing. Alright, I was really hoping that was going to be one of those weird... One of those weird, um... Heal your Pokemon here. Oh. Well, what's his face is probably gonna is probably gonna heal me, right? Do I really want to risk it though? I've already fought him. I think I have to. I think I have to go down. I haven't been down here yet. I wonder if there's a hidden item. Anything? I, I'm like mashing this button. I should probably get a, a softer controller because I'm. I would guarantee that my mic is picking up all of this, and I apologize. All right, let's. Let's get going. Yeah, hail Giovanni, yeah, we know. We don't need to worry about that. He's already he's already beaten. Hail Giovanni again. Hail Giovanni screamed it. Voice recognition, there it goes. Uh I don't think I need to worry about anything ju well, I I mean the electrodes though. Oh. Oh no, not the electrodes though. This is the double battle. Uh, let's see. Whatever she has said before, it'll hurt Team Rex pride over and over again, making it less than you see. So it's time to finish you, however strong you may be. If the two of us fight with you at the same time, you have no chance of winning. Don't you agree? Guess I'm not going to get thrashed. Sorry about that. Lance is all that. 2 and 2 battle. That's so unfair. Typical Team Rex be so sneaky. Let me to join the battle. Hadn't accomplished the whole time. Yep. The Red Baron himself. I don't know why I said the Red Baron, but his name's the Red Baron now. Get over it. All right. So Don and Tristan, Galele and Wingle. Okay. So I am... Oh, no. I totally forgot it's not going to be... Oh, shit. <laughs> I thought it was... Oh, no. I thought it was going to be a Dragonite. Oh, I didn't really think this one through. Okay, so... Like, Puntator still does Puntator thing, their Puntator things, though. Um, I'm really terrified of that Galele. They, if they double into Puddentator after burn, I am done. I can't really bring a Shemex. I could bring out Hannah. I could bring out Hannah for the Galele, but not really for the Wingle. But do I care about the Wingle is the question. I know I could go Shucky, but I just I just don't really care enough to, to really cheese Wonder, Wonder Guard. Let, let's try Hannah. Let's see what happens here. Okay, Galele is Protect. Toad Dial is... Oh, okay, Toad Dial. I, I see you. Um, so I should be faster. I should be able to take out Galele with one hit. Correct? Yes. Which means Toad should be able to take a Golbat or at least get it close. I'd love to get it down to just one Pokemon. Um, but I, I knew I would go first, so that's the only reason why I focused that one. Uh, Thrash. I don't think Thrash is going to help you too much here. It has to survive, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Use Bite. That doesn't do shit. Not very effective. Awesome. Do I love Doe Duo. I love Doe Duo. Uh, let's hit, let's hit Doe Duo with an Ember as well. 
Doduo is not the beefiest Pokemon yet, so that's an easy one. Totodile is probably still using Thrash for at least this turn, if not next turn as well. But they should be down to just one Pokemon, which is Tristan's Ace. Okay, I'm level 35, so I'm like level cap for Jasmine's Gym, but technically, what, Price? Price's Gym? I think that's the name, Price. Okay, Palace Wine. So, oh, <laughs> I keep forgetting. Every time I see a Palace Wine, it always seems that I have Han Hao, and I'm like, well, okay, it's just going to run me with a Ground Slate. But then I remember that it has that it has Drought, which powers up my Ember. So this might actually kill it. Yeah, there we go. I believe that that's exactly what happened last time. I feel like that was, was that Morty's Ace? Or one of Morty's Pokemon? No, it was like Morty's Start, and it just, I ran it. Or is Morty's Second, because I think he might have had the Waylord. Uh, too bad if you join Team Rocket, you'd be an executive. Yeah, it's good. I mean, I I'd love to join Team Rocket. That'd be sick. That'd be a sick game, not the Team Rocket edition that's, that's out right now is like the ROM hack, but like that, that'd be cool if that was something you were able to do is join the evil team as like a split story for a Pokemon game. Uh, but that's fine. The broadcast experiment was a total success. It doesn't matter what happens to the side out now. We have much bigger plans. You will appreciate us soon enough. Enjoy yourself while you can. Tee hee. Um, you're just gonna, you're just gonna heal me, sir? 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 Okay. Uh, this machine that's causing all the problems, you have no choice but to make them all faint. Uh, sir, sir? 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 Would you like to heal me? I guess probably not. Okay. So, we already got an encounter here, which was Kestform, I believe, but this is a static encounter. I think all three of these are different. So, I guess it's just going to be whichever one we run into first, because I, I just, I don't want to, I don't want to give myself a, another, another option to, to just have three Pokemon. Um, we, we did that before, and, and I, I don't think it was bad, but, I mean, we, we got, we got, you know, Puntator, so, we already, we already got the MVP. We're gonna heal, we're gonna heal him up. Um, I'm a big fan of middle. Let's see what we got. I'm a big fan of middle. What do we got? A Starly! I'm, I'm actually okay with a Starly. I am actually okay with a Starly. Um, my only issue with it is normal flying, right? So we already have a normal type, we already have a flying type. Technically speaking, because they're statics, would we get all? No, I, I feel like that's not fair. I feel like that's not that's not fair. Um, I really, really like Staraptor, but it doesn't have Intimidate. Um, if, if I can, I'll just catch all three of these. Uh, I'll probably just end up keeping the Starlight. I just want to see if any of them have, have uh, held items. Um, just just because. Let, let's just throw a Great Ball right now, see what happens. Okay, we got Starly. We are going to name you... Gonna name you Fohawk. Cause way back when, I used to rock a Fohawk. So there's that. What are you, Krabby? Oh, Krabby would have been sick. Krabby would have been sick. Um, I hit you with a Sandstorm. Okay, Harden. I would. Well, Rock Smash won't do too much. Yeah, I was gonna say Rock Smash won't do much. Um, we'll hit you with, we should be able to catch you with a regular Pokeball. I don't think you're difficult to catch. Okay, Krabby, we're not going to name you. I just want to see if you have a held item. Pincers, Durka Durka. Awesome. And then final one, a Squirtle. Okay, I'm actually, I'm happy that I, that I stuck with the Starling. I'm cool with that. Sandstorm again. I don't care about your Protect. There's that. Um, I don't think I'll be able to catch you with a Pokeball. Yeah, I don't think so. I'll try again. Water gun. All right, sandstorm. I'll just, I'll just waste a bunch. Oh, okay, I guess I don't need to waste a bunch of Pokeballs. Cool, tiny turtle Pokemon. Back to the PC. We did the thing. What's Lance have to say? Uh, let's see. Found this. Found it here. Don't have a need for it. HMO5. It's HMO5 Waterfall? Whirlpool? Whirlpool. There we go. Um, need the Mahogany Town badge for it. I don't know if it's actually necessary to to grab Lugia and Ho-Oh for, for um, a playthrough. But if we if we need it, then we need it. If not, then not. That's pretty cool. Alright, do we just... I think we, we step on that to get out of here. Fast track right on out. Professor Oak, what you got? Professor Oak, catch a lot of Pokemon, aren't you? Okay, I guess. Thanks, Professor Oak. Always, always the informative. 
Um, let's, uh, let's set up the heel. I'm going to cut so I could stretch real quick. And then I'll see you at the Mahogany Town gym for the end of the episode. All right. And we are in, is it Price? Price's gym? Or Bryce? Price. All right. Price the ice user. Um, normally this would be an issue for Garchomp and not an issue for Hannah, but here we are. Let's start sliding. Oh, I guess we're not. Oh, we don't. Okay. We don't slide around, I guess. It has been so long since since I've done this. Um, and I, I, I guess I'm just going to save anyways, because that's what I do is save. So, all right, sweet. There's that. All right, into the gym. Um, I don't really remember too much about this. I don't know if I'm able to get around a lot of these fights or... Oh, okay, I see what happens. You got to... Okay, you got to fight them to get to the proper part of the ice. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine. Uh, to get to Price or Gym Leader, you need to think before you skate. Well, joke's on you. I don't have any skates. Um, we have Pokemon that are levels 35 and under before we started the gym, so they are all... Oh, Trace the Hydration. Okay, nine, Trace Ninetales would actually be really cool, honestly. Um, but all Pokemon are going to be legal at this point for this gym battle, just because I've been doing the um, hit the aces level or lower at the start of the gym not the gym leader itself just just because i don't think we've exploited that too bad so or at least we haven't went out of our way to do it um i don't know cool so okay so we only need to fight one at a time you're looking all over the place that's cool not creepy i feel like you need to do oh can i actually not go there's that there's that. Oh, is that wrong? That might actually be wrong. Um, let's see what we could do here. Push that over. Let's let's reset this. Let's reset this. I feel like the answer is literally just fight this guy and then Oh, okay. So you can probably just look back down. There's that. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And is that it? Is that all I need to do, or do I need to push one up? And You know what? Let's fight this check, see what happens. Check out my parallel turn. I don't know what that means. I was a snowboarder when I was younger, not a skier. I never learned pizza and french fries. Ooh, good bite. Look at you. Look at you being adorable. All right, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to slap you in the face. That should be fun. However, now that I think about it, if I face a Giratina, I think a Dragon Claw or... I feel, I feel like a Dragon Claw on a Giratina would actually two-shot it from Street Shark. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, so there's, there's that, right? So, nothing I can do with that. I really, I really just don't want to fight people and, and overthink this. That sounds like an awful lot of work. Oh, okay, but I... Oh, I'm dumb. Okay, well, that's what I'm going to do anyways. I think I know what I need to do. So we'll, we'll do this. Uh, what you got? Ranger Jonathan. There's been a lot of Jonathans. Shout out my cousin, I guess. Marsh Tom, I don't think you... I don't think you're carrying, like, Ice Punch or anything crazy. So I'm going to just slap you with a Dragon Claw. Uh, Price only has three Pokemon, so I'm not going to worry too much about how many points... Or how many more uses I have left on my Dragon Claw. Though I feel like I probably should. I could probably get away with a Rock Smash. I know you don't have Sturdy. And if you do, how ironic. Oh my god, how are you? How are you still alive? I, I mean, I get it, you're a behemoth, but Jesus. Rock Tomb, that's my speed. Yeah, adorable, adorable. I don't really care about it. We're going to Rock Smash anyways. Get that out of here. Now I'm kind of curious. Kind of curious what that was. Ooh, good, a while. Probably my favorite fairy type. Probably my favorite fairy type. But, unfortunately for you, how are you still alive? Was it Sturdy and I just didn't see? I mean, I, I, I guess so. I guess that's cool. Uh, so, okay. Oh, I'm dumb. I'm, okay. Hold on. And I did not mean to do that. Is there... Okay, so do I hit this over? 
And then this up. Oh, it locks in. It locks in. So do I not want that? Or do I hit one up and then hit the other one over? I'm tr I'm really trying not to think about this in a, in a puzzle kind of sense. I just, I'm, I'm too lazy. There's that. There's that one. So, okay. Ugh. Am I really gonna have to think about this? Am I really gonna have to think about this? I really don't want to. I really don't want to. I, does that have to do with it? All right, you know, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna cut. I'll come back to it. I'll, I'll sit here and take a real good look at it and maybe get a drink of water because it's hot. So I will be right back. All right, I'm, I'm back. That was, that was dumb. That, that cut was literally like a 32 second cut. So I don't, anyway, whatever. So here we are. Uh, I'm just gonna keep leading Garchomp. I think I think level 35 Garchomp is fine. His typing is pretty much what I need. I, I literally gave him Rock Smash for anything that I feel like I couldn't cover with the rest of the team. So I'm, I'm gonna start Garchomp and we're, we're, we're gonna go. We're gonna go. Yeah, it says my cut was at 123.15. I came back at like 124. So, all right, so I too have seen and suffered much in my life. Since I'm your elder, let me show you what I mean. I've been training Pokemon since before you were born. Do not lose easily. I, Price, the Winter Trainer, shall demonstrate my power. I will, I will, I will, eat my hat that I'm not currently wearing if you have a single ice type. Oh, shit. He, ha he has three Pokemon. Okay. Well, th you know, there's a chance. There's a chance that he has an ice type. Maybe I want to take that back. Maybe I want to take that back. Okay. I don't think I need to worry too much about chip damage with Sandstorm right now, and it doesn't affect me because I'm really not rock. So, let's Dragon Claw. Um, I think this is our best case scenario lead against Jolteon. Just just being the ground type. Uh, a Venusaur wouldn't be too... Jesus. Why? Uh, Venusaur wouldn't have been too bad here. And uh, Lily wouldn't have been too bad here, but okay. Well, I guess I'd rather you use a Hyper Potion on your lead instead of your Ace, so that's fine. Hopefully, we get a high roll this time, so we could kill it. Survey says, all right. Survey says, D E D, twelve sixty six. Sends out a Jinx. All right, so I have a Yachi Berry. I have a Yachi Berry. It is Psychic Ice type. It is Psychic Ice type. I have a Yachi Berry. Like, I, I guarantee that I just one-shot this. Well, like, I type for type beat it with Hannah, correct? I type for type beat it with Hannah. So let's just, you know, let's just do that. Let's let's go, Hannah. Let's let's not risk it. 34. I believe this is actually his ace. So Hannah's ready for it. Hits me with a mean look. Is that? No, that doesn't paralyze. Does that slow me down or make me so I can't, I can't leave? Okay, I can no longer escape. And it's probably for the best that I did it here. So I definitely would have would have killed Jinx. I would have two shot it. Um, I uh, maybe that was a wrong move because I'm a special attacker, but Jinx has a wicked high special special defense. Citrus Berry, uh, Fake Tears. Oh, is, is that my is that my physical attack? Anyways, special defense. Oh boy, this okay. This is getting interesting. Um, do I hit it with another Ember though? Do I hit it with a, with a with another ember? What's my Okay, let's let's see here. My attack is 77, my special attack is 99. Um Well, bite has a, also has a chance to flinch. So let's let's do that. Okay, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Yeah, it's it, it's it's a glass cannon on the physical side, so I figured that was that was a better the better option. Um hail continues. I'm taking damage. I think I'm able to I think I'm able to escape now. Yeah, I am quite the trainer. Thank you very much. Um I, I'd love to send in Flora, but I, I feel like I've done such a bad job keeping it leveled. Um, I don't I don't think it has... Oh, wait, hold on. That was actually a nice type. I'm not eating a hat. That is not... I mean, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'll get a little candy hat and I'll eat it just so I'm a man of my word. Let me, let me send in Flora. Let me send in Flora here because I feel like it wants to go for a water attack anyways. I don't think it has an ice attack. I mean, at level 32, it definitely could have learned, like, Ice Beam. But... Uh, speed fell. That's fine. We're both going to take damage. Uh, I'm just going to hit it with a Leech Seed. Metal Claw. Okay, just don't get a... Okay, cool. We're both taking damage. Leech Seed. That's awesome. I feel like I kill it with Razor Leaf. 
Okay, still not getting the attack bonus. I didn't miss my Razor Leaf. This'll, this'll, this'll actually probably kill. I figured I one-shot it anyways, but in case I had to switch again, I went, okay. Okay, it didn't. It actually didn't. That's that's impressive. Um, it's interesting that I believe in the older gens, or do you take damage? For No, I think in the newer gens, you heal before you take damage. Uh, Willow is flexible. Who the who the hell is Willow? Excuse me. I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna send in something else because because I can. Uh, you've been using Bubble Beam and that, so I'm just gonna send a Shucky. I'm gonna send a Shucky. Oh, wait, I've been using Metal Claw. Well, I've made better decisions. Oh, use a full restore. Okay, well, you know what? That was, I just wanted to get experience anyways. We'll, uh, we'll go back. I know I'm just messing around at this point. I probably shouldn't be. Let's go, let's go Tree Shark. Let's finish this. This should be the last turn for Hail. Leech Seed, I'm gonna hit it with a Slash. Oh, I had Rough Skin. Okay. Well, at least it's dead now. Cool. Shucky got him. Oh, I forgot. Shucky gets boosted experience because it's technically trade. Uh, seems if my luck has run out. 4,000 monies. I'll take that. I'm pressed by your powers. Oh, with your strong will, I know you'll overcome life's obstacles. You're worthy of this badge. The Glacier Badge. These badges have a significantly better naming um, structure than Gen 6 did. The Psychic Badge, the the Grass Badge, right? Was one the Grass Badge or something like that? It was, it was dumb. Okay, so normally Team 07 is Hail. We'll check this out real quick. Always interested to see... Ooh, Crunch! Please tell me I could teach this to Garchomp. Yes! Awesome. That is that is awesome. Because it learns it by level up, but it takes so long. So long. I mean, unless I'm wrong here, but I saw like level 60 something. So we're gonna we're gonna get rid of a sandstorm because like he's he's not he's not in for chip anymore. He's he's in for the kill. Okay, we'll we'll get out of this we'll get out of this gym. We'll wrap it up. Um, this was this was a long episode. I was actually just gonna make this like a 25 minute episode. Professor Elm, what you got? How are things? Call because something weird is happening with radio broadcast. Talking about Team Rocket, you know anything about it? Team Rocket just for sure. That's not true. Sorry to bug you. Do I need to go back to Goldenrod? Is that something that I actually need to do? I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. That's not something I'm too concerned about. Okay, before we wrap this up, though, um, I wanted to get a headbutt encounter and treat it as a mahogany town. I feel like the moment that I step past this guy, it's not... Excuse me? Oh. Uh, okay. I already, already did both those things. I already did the sightseeing. Okay, so I guess I need to go. All right. Well, we're gonna we're gonna get that account in next time. Um, I guess we're doing the radio tower, possibly. But regardless, we'll do we'll do whatever we have to start with, and then we're going to end at the very least with uh, with the gym, right? At the very least, probably something like that. Anyway, oh wait, actually no, we got we got two gyms. We actually did. I was gonna cut it after the Team Rocket thing. I guess I didn't want to. Well, you're welcome. That sounds that sounds conceited. I'm not gonna say you're welcome. That's very weird. Thanks for sticking around. Um, again, long episode, lots of cuts. I one, two, three, four, five. I better learn how to edit very quickly. But thanks for sticking around. Thanks for making it to episode eight. I'm actually really enjoying this. Um, leave me a. I'm not even gonna ask for likes and comments. That's not something that I really care about i know it's really good for marketing to remind you to like and subscribe leave a comment that kind of thing but I, I really just want some interaction that's it that's all i care about some interaction so please leave a comment tell me what you like what you don't like do i cut too much do i not cut enough is there a lot of a lot of times where i'm not talking a lot that you'd like to just say okay hey just jump to the battles jump to something you know important battles that kind of thing because i i guess i i did the team rocket hideout and what 20 20 or 25 minutes something like that it took me and i guess i could have wrapped it up into about five minutes so i could fit a lot more but then it's going to cut down on how many episodes we have in our series so and i'm fine with that i'm fine with that so leave a comment let me know let me know if you like these longer episodes or if you really just only care about encounters and major battles um yeah until next time i hope you all have a day as wonderful as you are thanks for thanks for sticking around